Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here, and welcome back to World of Warcraft, the Burning Crusade Classic, and our Rogue playthrough. We are doing Shadowfin Keep again today. Yes, this is the second time we have done SFK on this character. Sorry if SFK is not your favorite dungeon in the world, it's one of my favorite dungeons, and it was the group that I was able to get into today. Between trying to get into Black Fathom Deeps and uh, SFK, we got into SFK, so here we are. Our tank is still a pretty new tank, and just because you missed it, I'm pretty sure our healer... Uh, yeah, he said this right here. You can take a look at that. So we'll see how the run goes, but it should be interesting. Uh, we have a paladin, a priest, a paladin, a hunter, and ourselves. So it should be an interesting run. We have our poisons up, so that's good. Last time we were here, we did not even have poisons. I'm going to turn the floating health bars on here, so, you know, we can actually see what health everything is at. Make informed decisions about what we're attacking. And last time we were in here, we had a warrior tank, I believe it was, who kept needing on and winning all of the agility gear. So, kind of hoping that maybe we'll get a couple pieces today. Although we have a hunter here, so that kind of reduces our chances. We have an all blood elf run. Very, very special. <laughs> that makes perfect sense. That is what you see on Horde side so much of the time, is you just get these all blood elf runs because, you know, they're the pretty race. I mean, I can't, I can't disagree with that. I'm, I'm playing a Blood Elf right now. I could have played anything. For me, it's not necessarily that they're the pretty race. It's that right now they have the higher pixel count, so... Yeah. Oh, uh, we can skin in here, and we will try to do so. Try to also, you know, stay engaged in fighting. But uh, I do want to skin some stuff. Getting some medium leather, uh, which is nice. We are not using medium leather yet. I have a little bit of work to do on our leather working skill to get that skilled up. All right, new tank, you've got this. Just run on down there and see what happens. Uh, maybe we want to kill these ads first, might be a great idea. We have a warg on us. I'm going to pop evasion here, so we're just not taking a lot of damage. Oh, we're just going to go on the boss. Okay, I wish I'd have known that. It's fine, it's fine. Uh, yeah, some agility shoulders would be nice. We're, we're going to roll on them, see if we can have some luck going here today. Don't really know who's looting before the fight's over, but... What are you going to do? Waiting for the rolls to finalize here. We did win with a roll of eight because nobody else rolled on it. So yeah, happy about that. That was one of the things that the warrior I think took from us last time was he rolled on these leather shoulders. Much to my chagrin. But I'm kind of realizing like, yeah, some of the gear in here is a lower level, isn't it? Like if we look at these shoulders, uh, stamina and spirit, I'd probably rather have the agility, but... This is kind of a, a lower level dungeon for us, I guess, at this point. Even though we're all, well, we have a couple level 20s here, but a few of us are higher level than that.
I'll say it's nice being in here and having a bunch of rested experience. I'll say, oh, I aggroed some shit. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> It'll be okay. See, everything is fine. It's all fine here. Now, the music is really, really kicking out. Hope that's not too loud for you guys. The one thing we really don't have as a rogue, at least so far, is we don't have any kind of AoE. So there is that. Not that AoE is incredibly prevalent, but we don't have any. We don't even have like a cleave or anything like that. We can use the time while everyone drinks to go ahead and skin some stuff here. Doesn't seem like anyone else is really skinning anything, so I think we basically have free reign of whatever we want in here. Uh, yeah, the run is probably going to be worth it just for the medium leather alone, even if we don't get any other pieces of gear, and even if the gear is a little bit lower level. So many greens are dropping. I mean, we might as well just kill the horses. They're right here. They're not really a big challenge, and people don't really avoid them as much as they used to. I don't know if it's that they have a chance to drop a bag, maybe? Can't really remember. They have a chance to drop something that's slightly useful to somebody. And we can skin them. Oh, 
Uh, doesn't look like we could kick that. I did get the kick off in time, but it, it didn't seem to stop the cast. That's good to know. We, we won't bother trying to kick that in the future. Oh, hi there. Inventory is full. That's what you want to see at the start of a dungeon. I thought I had done a decent job of ditching everything that I didn't need. Uh, but obviously that is not the case. Let's get rid of some junk here and maybe make it through the rest of the run. Oh, we have a bunch of these. That's why my inventory is completely screwed. Makes perfect sense. Uh, do I need the Shredder Operator? No, I don't. I'm not doing that quest. Let's get rid of it. I saw three people go this way and one person go that way, so we are going to go this way. the butcher's cleaver we can't use axes can we uh, I actually don't know I actually don't know let's find out rogues cannot equip any one hand or two handed axes Okay, that's good to know. I am very inexperienced with the rogue. As you guys know who have been watching the series. We could interrupt that, whatever it was. I mean, you are a hunter. No one is gonna stop for you to get mana. If you if you want mana, now is the time. I noticed that you're not uh, you're not drinking. Oh, it was not the hunter that said it. Okay, good. It was the it was the tank. The text bubble looks that looked like it came up uh, above the hunter. Guess that's why I should be looking in chat and not looking at the chat bubbles.
All right, I'll skin one more. Why not? Uh, this might be a little bit of a problem. Try to work on these guys in the order of their health. Try to get them down as quickly as possible here. Uh, you're next because you're attacking the healer it looks like. Okay, that worked out pretty well, after all. Very good. Very well handled, group. Uh, I think I'm just gonna go on the boss here. Seems like the best thing to do is just to burn him down instantly. There's a nice shield for our new tank. Should appreciate that one. Six strength, three stamina, increases your dodge, and has 623 armor. Very nice. Look at that, he equipped it right away. That's what you like to see. You like to see a tank who's a new tank getting geared up, equipping that gear, and yeah, we want him to keep tanking because boy, do we need tanks in this game. And like, with the average skill of players now being what it is, like tanks don't have to be amazing group leaders. They don't have to be even amazing at playing their class because people have enough knowledge of, of most of the, of the classes for the most part to kind of make up the slack uh, in a way that probably wasn't always true. So I hope people like this have a good experience as their new tanking goes and that they continue doing it because the game really needs them to. I'm gonna let him get some aggro in here before we start doing very much. There we go. What do we have left in here? Two bosses left? We're actually making really, really good time. Uh, I'm not- I don't want to hit this guy too much. Okay, he, I thought he was going to continue pulling, but... Come on, tab targeting. T target the guy in front of us. Uh, let's let him get this. Oh, 
Haunting Blade Dropped. Two-handed weapon. Increases attack power. Oh, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Very nice for somebody. I hope. There we go. The DPS Paladin. Yeah, that's a... That's good. It's nice when it, an upgrade goes to the person who is in the role who needs it most. Could have been something that the tank easily took for himself for his uh, DPSing spec, but I'm glad that the DPS Paladin got it. That's a really cool looking sword, too. Okay, whatever that was, we cannot kick that. Periodic skill reduction. I don't really know what periodic skill reduction means. Stamina and spirit, or agility and stamina. I think I'm gonna need this thing, and I'm gonna replace the Ring of Scorn, maybe. Huh. Let's take it. Did we need off against somebody and then not get it? Or what? Oh yeah, we lost the roll. Alright, uh, gloves we don't need. It's randomly reducing our skill at using two-handed maces. Isn't that, like, completely random? This Forsaken skills. That's actually hilarious. Huh. Yeah, I've never seen that before. We have a lot of enemies to contend with. Seems like it's gonna be okay. The tank is out of mana, but that's not really a big deal. At the moment. A lot of looting going on while these enemies are still up. That's all I'm saying. A lot of looting going on. It's nice after all that being the one person that does not have to sit down and drink. It feels good, man. I like it.
Oh, uh, we did not want to go into stealth there. That was a misclick. Uh, this guy melted. He absolutely melted. We'll roll on it. And we actually won it. So there we go. That's the other item. Now the problem is, I need to actually have room in my inventory. Uh, which is not going to happen like this. Uh, don't worry guys, we'll help out in a second here. Just trying to get our inventory straight. Let's equip this, which we can't do while we're in combat. And there we go. Uh, let's drop the clam meat in case we pick up anything else we need. Some medium leather. Not bad. Another cape that looks like a throw rug that you would put in your entryway for people to step on. Uh, can I... There we go. All fixed. Oh, everyone's gone. <laughs> While Robert plays around in his menus, the group progresses. Oh, it wasn't the whole group. Okay. Good. I was going to say, I didn't see everybody run past me. But... I have to say that doing dungeons on the rogue and not having to worry about mana, it's such a joy. It makes the whole experience such a joy. We, we just do the buttons and have a good time pressing them and we don't have to sit between pulls or eat or anything. And I really do enjoy it. This is coming from someone who spent most of his time in dungeons either healing or tanking. Uh, and it's just, it's good to be on a DPS class and you know, we don't have to lead the group. We don't have to worry about people's health. We can just focus on doing damage. And even after that, we don't have to worry about drinking to full. Uh, it's, it's really, really enjoyable to me. That being said, I, I like tanking. Um, don't get me wrong. Probably my favorite role to fill. In classic, at least. In retail, I hate it. So, there's that. Oh, uh, well, that's cool. Nice piece of caster gear there. I guess I didn't know this was a boss. Wolfmaster Nandos. Yeah, no idea. Alright, Aragal, come on down. Uh, we are definitely ready. The ready check is really cute, though. I like it. You too shall serve.
All right, that was incredibly easy. There's the meteor shard. We can only equip one of these, so uh, we already have one. Not sure if that's going to be useful for anybody else. But yeah, there we go, guys. That is a complete run of Shadowfang Keep. It was smooth, it was painless, it was enjoyable. We did gain a level with the kill experience in here, and we got two items out of it. So yeah, that's a big win. I am really happy with that. Thank you guys so much for being here. I really do appreciate the support. If you enjoyed the video, consider subscribing to the channel and leaving a like. That would really help me out a lot. And if you want to support me and what I do more directly, check out the join button on YouTube and see if any of the potential perks there interest you. I'm planning some special series for members only in the future and running that with polls that kind of decide what we play, where we play, and how we progress. But yeah, thanks for being here. Take care of yourselves out there in the real world and take care of each other. And we will see you back in Azeroth sometime soon. Bye now.